Are we live? Are we live? Yay, everything's working now. I streamed for like 30 seconds a while ago, but my PC was having some problems, so I re rebooted it. But we're live now. So, we're on to Batman the Enemy Within. Uh, two days ago, I streamed the first Batman Telltale series. It was really good. I have... Uh, so, everything I did from... Batman, the first Batman Tuttle series, I have continued my story on to The Evil Within instead of remaking everything. So, if you want to, if anything you is confusing, go watch the first Batman Tuttle series before you watch this. If you are watching this, if you're in the stream, how's it going? Anyways, uh, I did notice from watching my last Batman stream that the audio was a tad bit off. Like, sometimes the voice would be too high, sometimes it would be too low. So, maybe I fixed that. I don't really know. But, uh, I'm going to do one more mic check just to make but, uh, sure it's not super loud. I'm going to do one more mic check just to make sure it's not super loud. Alright, it sounds okay. Whatever. Alright, we're about to get into it. I had to check out something on Twitter real quick before I get started. Do 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 Anyways, so yeah, let's get into it. Episode 1 of the Enigma, obviously, I'm pretty sure I know what that means. Uh, one of Gotham's oldest and deadliest criminals has returned. Um, Enigma, Edward Enigma, is, is, is the name I'm guessing they're going with, which is the Riddler, which I can also guess that by the somewhat question mark cane there. So, potentially, we have the Riddler for this episode. So, yeah, let's get right into it. Um... While I'll start this, I've been getting follows. Purple, obviously. Gotta go for purple. I've been getting a lot of followers, but like none of them are staying followers, and it's all the names are kind of similar. So, someone is somewhat view like like follow botting me, and I wish you would stop, Mr. Lunar. He, you followed me on like eight different accounts, and you like would unfollow. I don't know why you're doing that. You need to quit it. You little shit. One fateful night, my parents gave their lives for me. Uh oh. They became my heroes. Their legacy. So yeah, I carried on all my Telltale Until series, the first one, the truth. to this one. So hopefully, it all worked out. Was a criminal. Because I think you it could get kind of glitchy. Them from the shadows, and everything I thought I knew about myself changed forever. The children of Arkham exposed the truth about my father to Gotham. Their attack turned friends into enemies and threw the city into chaos. I was committed to Arkham Asylum, where I escaped with the help of a mental patient named John Doe. After a bloody battle, I put an end to it all in the catacombs beneath the city. The Penguin, Two-Face, and Lady Arkham were the first real challenge I faced as the Batman, but they would not be the last. He never became Two Face, did he? Spring in the series I played, he never Gotham, became Two Face. And with what it the comes fuck? City Hall's quarterly crime report. Crime is well, besides way down burning his body, kind of. Not his face, though. Another triumph for newly minted police commissioner James Gordon. In a statement this morning, Gordon credited his success to the public partnership between the police and the Batman. He praised the mysterious vigilante for his sacrifice. Describing him as essential to the security of the city. Things yep. are looking up, citizens. The Riddler, Edward After the long, dark winter <laughs> comes the thaw. Now, if only the Knights could win a game, everyone would be happy. Lucky 13! There it is. Rumi Mori. Yeah. Import export magnet, one time Pipex CEO, international arms dealer. The world sees Maury as a legitimate businessman, a philanthropist who gives to charity, 
Not a criminal getting rich off the suffering of innocence. A masterful performance. I wonder... If a man hides in plain sight for that long, does he forget who he really is? What do you think, Master Bruce? Must be hard to stay true to yourself. I don't. I never forget what drives me. Protecting the innocent from people like Mori. That stays the same no matter what mask I wear. Don't I know? Masks are hard to maintain. If there are cracks in Mori's, we'll find them. The GCPD Whoa, what the hell? His penthouse and found nothing. I have that computer contacts. Deals in Gotham. They happen on the casino floor. I need to find a way to hear what Mori is saying. Standing by for support. Look for something with a microphone. Al, I'm hacking into Mori's phone. Encrypting your signal. Last thing we want is for him to know you're here. We're in. You should be able to pick up audio from Maury's phone. Is everyone enjoying themselves? Don't worry. I won't tell anyone with a bad... He's on a roll. <laughs> it's only a matter of time before he gets too chatty. <laughs> Try to blend in. Okay. So, I've been sitting over there wondering, what's Bruce Wayne doing in a place like this? Gambling? What the fuck are you doing I figured here? you went to fancier casinos. I'm looking for something different. New thrills. Well, it's a good thing you're here. And it's a good thing I'm here. Mm. You? What in the hell are you doing here? Stop me if you've heard this one before. I begin and have no end. And I end all that begins. Who am I? I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I told you ten times. Our arrangement is over. Death, Mori. I am death. Something's happening, and it doesn't look like a deal. The man in the hood. I remember him from your father's time. I think that's Riddler. My father knew Riddler? Is something wrong? Yes. You seem distracted. Very wrong, ma'am. Leave. Bruce. Please get away from me. Now. What? Just turn around and start walking. <laughs> You're lost, rich boy. You're not all that, you know. I just saved your life, bitch. No I should have picked a different option. In my own casino. Security! Sir, it's time to leave. For you? An easy one. What question can you never answer yes to? I don't give a crap, let's go! <sighs> Wrong. The correct answer is, are you dead? <laughs> now, let's get started. What's up with the British accents? Is Gotham British? Get out of there. Get your suit. I don't know. The background for most characters are I have like Look American accents. Happened. Right away. But Hey, no one leaves. The penguin and Riddler have British accents, so why is that? Hostages at the casino. What happens if someone walks outside and sees a man in a mask. me changing into the Batman? Riddler's back in Gotham. Riddler? He hasn't been seen in years. Well, he's putting on quite a show. There's a squad. 
squad on the way. They'll be there shortly. Be ready for a fight. Okay. It's pretty good so far. There's some questions. How does my dad know? How does Batman's dad know Riddler? Please, yeah, please. thanks for the follow, we Lunar Keyboard Head. Even though you followed you me on like eight different accounts now. Our issues can't be solved with handshakes, Maury. This is what happens when you back out of a deal with me. There's only one way you're getting out of this alive. You have to solve a riddle. And I'd choose my words carefully if I were you. Listen closely. No, please, don't do this! Without fingers, I point. Without arms, I strike. Without feet, I run. Who am I? I've got visual. That drone, fully functional. I'll need a place to drop in without being noticed. Time for some recon. It's a tricky one, isn't it? A mind bender that. Riddler. A terror from the past. I never thought I'd see him on our streets again. He's not to be taken lightly. It's the kind of conundrum that drives you to distraction. Some kind of torture device. Doesn't seem like he's getting out until he guesses the riddle. This Riddler certainly has an imagination. Same woman from before. Perhaps you should have turned on the charm. Batman will save her, along with everyone else. But don't think you can just stall. I will get bored. Cashier's booth. That'll do. Just need to take out the guard first. Audio playback fully functional. Time for a distraction. How do they not hear the drone? It's pretty loud. What the? Shut up. Shut up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Stop making noises, fucking idiots. I'm losing patience, Maury. Are you expecting a hint? Give me an answer. Batman, we can't get in. The front's covered by gunmen, and they've got the back barricaded with blackjack tables. How should I deploy when we're inside? I'm relying on your eyes and ears. What's the best course of action? Gear up. Make a frontal assault. Try and draw their fire away from me. You got it. You're completely insane. No. I don't believe that's it. Ooh. I'll clear a path. Wait for my signal. Give him hell. We're counting on you. Batman! You're ahead of schedule. I'm a little busy right now, but I'll see if I can fit you in. Okay, I'll be Not back later. The hostage. Shoot the hostage. Hey, Batman clearly uh, isn't using do I know head. you? Break it open. With pleasure.
Joker. <laughs> I've heard stories in the streets about you, Batman. You're the biggest name in Gotham since... Well, since I left town. Everyone's very impressed with you. Are they? I'm not impressed. Gotham's criminals have become zealots and thugs in cheap suits. And you, I've come home to find a wannabe in my chair. Eating my goddamn porridge. You don't know me, Riddler. You have no idea what you're up against. You must think you're so special. You're not the first hero I've put down. You're supposedly the world's greatest detective. Yet here you are, completely at Gordon, my mercy. No. Oh, you have to be kidding. Clever. But not smart enough! Let me show you how it was done back in the day. It just doesn't do it for me. Everyone's got grapples these days. Follow the power lines. There must be a weak point. Cheating. Think I care about your rules. I'd heard you were a man who followed a code. Why would you save that dirtbag's life? Maury made his money running guns. I save people. It's what I do. <laughs> your naivete is just embarrassing. I save people. <laughs> you should concentrate on saving yourself. Welcome to the stream. Roundhouse, what do you mean? Enough of this. You know Welcome how to, to the stream. I'll give you that. But it's not enough. We just started see how you the enemy with something a little more cerebral. Better hurry, detective. Solve my puzzle soon. Or people are gonna get hurt. And we know you can't let that happen. Who's that? You should have called us before going in, Gordon. Wow. Who are you? After all, we're here to help. Are you now? 
A lot of questions. Alright, that's chapter one of episode one done. Are we going to find out who that is? Circuitry inside, but nothing obviously dangerous. The back computer will be able to analyze further. We have an inventory now? That's kind of cool. Your days are numbered, bat freak. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Keep one eye in the sky, jerk offs. Heavens are gonna fall on your goddamn heads. Tell me all about it down at the precinct. The Riddler's right hand in custody? Not a bad result, all told. Didn't one of your officers get fucking Riddler blasted used by to a shotgun? Leave clues at all his crime scenes. Always thought he was smarter than the people trying to catch him. Thought we could use help. Dragging him down. Arrogance like that will be his undoing. He keeps showing off he's bound to make a mistake. Well, maybe, but we can't underestimate him. Riddler's heyday was a dark time in Gotham. And what we just saw, he hasn't mellowed with age. Uh huh. Get Fernandez on it right away. Commissioner Gordon. Brace yourself. Just so you know, this woman has a lot of juice with the governor. Rubber the wrong way, I could end up on foot patrol till I retire. My people are trained for situations like this, Gordon. We'd have Riddler in custody if you'd only picked up the phone. So, you're the legendary Batman. Maybe. I've heard a great deal about you. So much so, I don't know if I should believe the hype. And you are? This is Amanda Waller, director of the agency. What are the mm. feds doing here? Riddler's their case. The GCPD has been asked to open our doors to them. Give them whatever they need. We've been tracking that maniac for some time. No one knows more about him than we do. World-class criminals like Riddler, they're kind of our specialty. I've never heard of this agency. I'll take that as a compliment. We like to keep a low profile. <laughs> that means she operates from the shadows. So do I. As nice do to you. meet you. Oh. Riddler used to be a player in Gotham back when Thomas Wayne and Falcone ran the city. He disappeared so suddenly and for so long, everyone thought he was dead. <laughs> no, everyone no, was no. Wrong. Riddler's back. And if these theatrics are anything to go by, he wants the whole city to know. Yeah, we noticed that. My people tell me you did some good work handling him, Batman. Hell yeah. You I'm Batman. I bet we'd make a damn fine team. I don't know about I that. I don't really know you. Arkham. Not to mention the city's corrupt mayor, Dent. We could do great things together if we joined forces. I work with Gordon. No one else. I appreciate loyalty. But that there... That's the issue. Fight me. The only real problem with your setup is who you're working with. Local law enforcement clearly can't cut. It. I got a local crime rate says otherwise. <laughs> Ms. Waller, please, Commissioner. What was that charge of the light brigade crap with the riot shields? Good cops got hurt because of it. Not to mention you let Riddler slip through your fingers. Uh -oh. You GCPD cowboys clearly don't know what you're doing. You're putting all this on me? You're the commanding officer, aren't you? You can't put this on Jim. I made the call about a frontal assault. Then maybe you're not as impressive as I thought. That's why we I'm shouldn't work to together. I'm competence in the future. I gotta get a security detail on Mori while he's in the hospital. Agent Avesta will fill you in on what we know so far. Avesta. As a token of interdepartmental cooperation. The nerve on her. Don't tell these people a thing, especially about that puzzle. Noted. This is our town. We're the ones that'll catch Riddler. So, guys, he left the puzzle? Ooh, I thought she was gonna bite your head off for a second. Uh, I'd like to see her try. 
Special Agent Imanavesta, Field Intelligence Specialist on the Riddler case. And my partner. You have Agent green eyes. Do do? I don't like that. I put together this psychological profile of Riddler. You'll see when you read it. He's changed. For your eyes only. <laughs> if you catch my drift. The target of the casino. I don't trust her. Mori. After what and happened with the whole Vicky Bill thing. We don't trust her. something to do with why he's back in Gotham. He's a madman. You can't look for reason in someone so clearly deranged. Riddler does show signs of an obsessive compulsive disorder, but he's calculating, fiercely intelligent. I'd be surprised if this wasn't part of a bigger plan. Let me know if you think of anything. It'd be a help. Okay. I'm Gotham born and raised, you know. My dad ran a store in the shadow of City Stadium. Cool. I, don't I just care. wanted to say it's a real honor to meet you. Yep. I do have something I want to ask, though. No. The criminally insane. You're drawn to them, aren't you? What? There's something in you that pulls you towards the danger. You can't go two city blocks in Gotham without tripping over criminal scum. Most people just get up and run away. I'm not most people. I think I know you a little better now. Oh, she's a fucking. You can't have a file on Batman, goddammit. Agent. Batman, before you go, Gotham's your city. I respect that. But you should know I don't have to play nice. Mm -hmm. I'm letting you hunt the Riddler for now. Yeah, you they might you share are. everything you find. Or this courtesy call is gonna become something you really won't like. I don't care. I'm you Batman. Grapple away. <laughs> oh, the story's already kind of picking up. I like it. I do know the Joker will be in this later. I, th I think at the least he'll be there in episode 3. Just from speculation. Why do I have two bat suits? What's the other one? Is it newer? Better? What older? an eventful Worse? evening. I've taken the liberty of preparing some refreshments. Thank uh, you! Thanks, Al. I need to focus. Maybe music will help. Uh... No music, please. Don't want to get a copyright strike. I think a little classical is in order. Damn it! The first disc there. It's a favorite of mine. I'm gonna get DMCA'd by Batman. You can be fucking kidding me. The computer is finished scanning the Riddler's puzzle box. It's ready when you are. Let's get to work. Wow. Okay, we got Catwoman's goggles, Harvey Dent, uh, Penguin, Lady Arkham. Uh, I don't really care about any of that. We saw all that last episode. No explosives detected, no radioactivity. Nothing dangerous at all so far. Yeah, it's a riddle, Computer, Batman. Run another scan. I want to be absolutely sure this thing is safe. Riddles aren't also, completely dangerous. I took the liberty of digging up everything I could find on the agency. There's plenty here. Know your enemy and all that. Why is he shaking? Oh, no, is Alfred going to die this Batman? It, oh, come on. It comes and goes. Ever since the kidnapping and, and all the other business with Lady Arkham. Alfred. <clears throat> no, no, don't you worry about me. No, I, I, I should be fine. It was worse after my first tour of duty. Your family, Alfred. We worry about family. Thank you, Bruce. 
It'll pass. Working always helps. Beep, boop, boop, pop. The agency. The public face of a shadow committee of military leaders, intelligence experts, and government officials. Civil rights violations, domestic black sites, decentralized accountability. This information, it's all before Waller took over the director position. Perhaps she's given them a new direction. Maybe, but the agency's empowered to override local law enforcement with impunity. Oh, that man's got some competition in town. I wonder if we need be worried. Well, things won't be easy with a bunch of spies nearby. They're well-equipped spies, too. Maybe it wouldn't hurt to talk to Lucius about upgrades. <gasps> Lucius! Level the playing field. Yes. Talkie talkie. Yes. Riddler terrorized this city long before you were Batman. Gotham's original costumed criminal. Yes, to have him returned. It's unsettling. I don't remember that symbol. Remember I thought that symbol was a question mark. Underworld. Even Carmine Falcone gave him a wide berth. He was presumed dead for so long. Why come back to Gotham? Well, he seemed to have a prior relationship with Maury. Some kind of axe to grind. Let me upload the rest of this to the Codex. The agency realized Riddler was still alive when he orchestrated a prison break at Peña Duro. My men here say you let yourself get caught, Mr. Riddler. Just Riddler. Why willingly turn yourself in? Oh, Mr. Warden, to get everyone else out, of course. That wasn't obvious. The man's deranged. If you ask me, he needs help. Yep. Yeah. He's clearly sick. The man is in urgent need of a doctor. You're getting soft, Alfred. There's only one way to treat creeps like Riddler. And believe me, it's not therapy. Well, in this one case, Bruce, I'll concede your methods might be more appropriate. Thank you. What was that? You should see your face. Its confusion is delightful. I think I'll take it with me. I take everything back. Where to next, Batman? Let's see what Riddler's little gift is all about. Oh yeah. The Solve puzzle. my puzzle soon, or people will get hurt. Uh, Riddler's MO hasn't changed in all these years. Nah. Kind of boring, dude. Change up the game a little bit sometimes, fucker. What the hell am I doing? There's writing engraved along the rim. I have an eye yet cannot see. Who am I? That sounds familiar. Welcome I've heard to the stream. Don't happen to remember the answer, do you? Sadly, no. Um. I don't. I have an eye, but cannot see. Who am I? I don't know. This is hard. Do I just like pick one and hope it's right? One eye jack doesn't sound like it would be right. An eye of hurricane is possible. An eye of needle doesn't really make sense. Blind justice could makes sense an eye of a hurricane? Of a hurricane it fits the description in the riddle but I'm not sure how it helps us even if there were hurricanes in Gotham it's hard to imagine one helping us with the object in question if that is indeed the key oh what the hell Maybe a hurricane could have been like, 
you know what will happen in Gotham like a disaster man justice. blind justice I don't know to Batman maybe lady justice is blindfolded to show she's impartial she has two eyes under the blindfold though not Alfred you're not helping so at all else. the eye of a needle but how does that relate to the object in question? Oh my. Maybe it's telling us how to use it. Uh, sounds very plausible. Look at these strange grooves. What the hell was that? Find something to use the disc with. Maybe the back computer? Nope, never mind. Huh. I don't want to talk to Alfred. Uh. <gasps> this! Needle. A record needle. That makes a lot of sense now. Halfway there, Batman. Means you've got half a chance of stopping a whole lot of pain. To be honest, you're already doing better than I thought. But don't sit around feeling pleased with yourself. Unless you want to see me tear this city apart. I suppose you're going to look in there. An open invitation from the Riddler? Of course. Huh. Looks like I'm manipulating radio bands or waveforms. Something. I'm not sure what I'm looking at or how any of it is actually displaying. And that sound. What? Oh, uh... I'm not really sure about any of it. Get Lucius on the line, will you? Lucius! Alfred. Good morning, Lucius. I hope we're not interrupting your breakfast. It's morning? My youngest is probably stealing all the bacon, but duty calls. What's up? This is a puzzle from the Riddler. There's a strange waveform pattern I can manipulate inside that needs your expertise. I, uh, yeah, okay. Uh, I can meet you at Wayne Tower in a little bit. We'll uh, fire up the R&D lab. I wouldn't ask if it wasn't important, Lucius. No, no, don't worry about it. It's actually going to be a big day for me. Ooh. Tiffany starts at Wayne Enterprises. Who's Tiffany? Who's Tiffany? Really? Your daughter working <gasps> alongside you. Oh, that's, that's cool. Wonderful. Uh, certainly is. Bruce, I'll see you soon. Bye, Lucius. Can't wait to see Tiffany. Bye, Alfred. I'll be at Wayne Town. Good hunting, Bruce. Hunting? Oh, for the Riddler? That makes a lot more sense, Alfred. That's chapter two done. I caught you. I have some good news to share. Good to hear, okay. Regina. It's what I've come to expect, with you as Wayne Enterprises chairperson. I just talked to the board, and our stock price has doubled since you took the company back from Oswald Cobblepot. The Gazette's running a piece about it. Look, I would love to hear all the details, but I've got a meeting with Lucius I've got to run to. Well, I don't mean to pry, but what's in that case? Seems like an odd thing to be carrying around the office. Oh, this? No. This is just something for Lucius. I see. Well, I've got a meeting I've got to run to. <laughs> no, it's we'll sus. Pick up this conversation this afternoon. Sounds great. Drugs. Drugs. It's drugs. You're in my chair. Just updating the encryption on your bat tech. But if you want me to stop? No, no, the seat is all yours. 
This is the thing you were talking about? One of Riddler's puzzles. Some kind of test. Show me. Huh. Any idea what he's planning? No, clue. not yet. That's why I need your help. If his history is anything to go by, he left us a clue. A psychological profile of Riddler. Uh, knowing how his mind works, this should come in handy. No sign of explosives or poison. Already scanned for that in the cave. You look at that micro pulse waveform oh, and the sound it's giving off. A signal, maybe <laughs> I couldn't decipher it. I was hoping you could help with that. Uh oh, I'll see what I can do. Shouldn't take long. Is that Tiffany? What is that? What in the it's not one of mine. Think fast. Oh, it's Tiff it's gonna be Tiffany, yeah. Tiffany? Tiffany, I thought it was, it, Hey, Bruce. It, it, it's very dangerous of you. Oh, my God, Tiffany. I could have thrown a battering. Sneaking out Broken. of orientation your first day? I just wanted to say hi to my new boss. I got you a present a micro drone prototype I developed in my spare time. High end AV, stealth black shell, programmable for autonomous observation. Small, quiet, and super smart. Just like its designer. Not bad, huh? You always had a thing for toys. So hard to know what to get a man who has everything. I love it. Thanks, Tiffany. Well, I guess it's not bad. Lucy's <laughs> like, it's See bullshit. <laughs> Thick my job. Huh. There's something different about you. Uh, my ears? ear? And I don't just mean what happened to your ear. <laughs> I can't quite put my finger on it. But you look... You look... Well, please just don't say old. Well, now that you mention it. Hey, play nice. <laughs> Bruce has had a rough year. Interesting. Don't. Too late. Already touching. Just be careful. What a Wait, strange does she, thing. Does she know? The circuitry design. It's elaborate and unorthodox. Almost intentionally so. Like whoever put it together was kind of showing off. Huh. Micro pulse waves? It's just weird. Seriously, what is this thing? I've never seen anything like it. It's like whoever made it. It's pretty cool, huh? I don't know if cool would be the word I would use. I can hear it hum. What does it do? That's what we're trying to work out. You guys are lucky I'm here to help. Uh, help with... Figure this freakish thing out. Well, Tiffany did graduate first in her class at Cornell in molecular engineering. Cool. Let me take a crack at it. Okay. I can help you get to the bottom of this. All right. If you think you can help, then be my guest. Oh, I know I can help. I just gotta let him know that I won't be finishing up orientation. Uh, no problem. Oh, I was planning on swinging by the manor after work to see Alfred. I heard he wasn't doing so well. <gasps> that he was having some issues with his health? He would love that. I hope he isn't still angered with me and Luke about that incident with the child. I'm completely trusting well, in Tiffany know, because it's Lucius' no daughter. Messes allowing her in my house and being friendly toward her. But if she ends up being a bad person, I'm going to be very mad. Catch you guys later. Welcome aboard, Tiffany. Thanks, boss. All right, then. Time to crack this puzzle. I never told her, you know. Told her what I really do at Wayne Enterprises. What uh, we do. If you're willing to pull her into this Riddler project, why not consider bringing her into the fold? Into the mission? We're going to need help. If we're going to be dealing with the likes of Riddler. And we can trust her. She's family after mm. all. Do you know what she wants, Lucius? It's not for us to decide her future. That's fair. 
It's just that our work means a great deal to me. I'd like to share that with her. Let's put a pin in this for now. I think we've got enough on our plates. Oh. Shall we go down to the lab? Actually, the equipment we need is down in my office. We'll get this taken care of in no time. Mr. Wayne. Uh, Why yes. are you here? I'm Special Agent Avesta. This is my partner, Special Agent Blake. Uh, well, I guess I'll see you in a bit. I'll be down in my office. See you later, Lucius. Good chat. Oh, yeah. One of the best. Sorry for the unannounced visit. We're with the agency's behavioral analysis unit. We just came by to ask a few questions. Please, come in. Make yourselves at home. Uh, can I get my assistant to get you anything? Uh, coffee, water, donuts? Don't worry. <laughs> this won't take long. <gasps> this office, it really represents you. Oh, I'd like to think Batman. so. Batman, Bruce, go hide that. Is this you? Yeah. Yes. How old? I don't know, seven, eight, maybe. <laughs> so happy. After everything you've been through, I don't know how you still do it. Do what, exactly? It wasn't long ago when you were the most hated man in Gotham. Yet you still give so much back to the city. Why do you continue to help Gotham? Most people wouldn't be so charitable after that. My father did a lot of damage to a lot of people. I'm just trying to make things right. Thomas Wayne did cast a long, dark shadow. It must be difficult to get out from under it. What, uh, what is it you want? The agency recently brought me in to draft a psychological portrait of the Riddler. We've been tracking him for months, but haven't been able to find him. Well, I'm sorry, I think you were in the wrong place. You see, I don't really consort with criminals, or international terrorists, for that matter. Yeah. <laughs> really? Because our sources say otherwise. A lot of things happened to you last year, and not all of them were good. You helped the GCPD capture Oswald Cobblepot, better known as the Penguin. He was a terrorist, a member of the Children of Arkham, and your friend. Come to think of it, you've been associated with quite a few psychopaths over the years. I Who hasn't? It's far. fucking Gotham. I would. The criminally insane, they seem drawn to you. Either that, or you're often in the wrong place at the wrong time. They're not attracted to me any more than the average citizen. We live in one of the most dangerous cities in the world, right? Stands to reason I'd run into a few psychos. Like this guy. I think you'd know him as John Doe. We understand that it was during your stay in Arkham where you and John met and became friends. From the sound of it, you two were close. You've got to be kidding me. He's no friend of mine. That's why you came here to ask me about that guy? According to hospital records, you and John were involved in a riot. They captured the whole incident on video. John cut another inmate, a man named Victor Zaz. Then you jumped into the fray. Several people were hurt. I was... I was trying to break up a fight. I don't blame you. You must have been scared. John was discharged from Arkham months ago. No one has seen or heard from him since. I was thinking maybe you have. <laughs> Why would you think that? He listed you as his emergency contact. <laughs> Fucking John. Like you two were pretty close to me. I did not agree to that. <laughs> Why would he write down my name? It's obvious. You're important to him. Well, I haven't seen or heard from him, so... Did he do something wrong? He's a person of interest. You see, we've got a wall in the office with a bunch of photos pinned to it. Two-Face, Penguin, Lady Arkham, you know, Gotham's most notorious. 
They've got all these little strings connecting them to one another, like a web. And you, my friend, are at the center. You keep pretty strange company for someone who wants everyone to think they're such a stand-up guy. I'm sorry, are you, are you accusing me of something? Should we be? You know more than you're letting on, Mr. Wayne. Maybe you're afraid. Maybe you don't trust us. Or maybe you're a criminal, like your father. Maybe you're not the hero people think you are. I am calling my lord. That's an evacuation warning. It's time for you to leave. We'll pick this up another time. Bruce, get my daughter out of the building. Get yourself out. What are you talking? What did you figure out? I've, I've solved the Riddler's puzzle, Bruce. Uh, Riddler really pulled a good one over on us. Lucius, just stay calm, okay? I'm gonna get you out of here. Tell Tiffany that I love her. That I'm sorry I wasn't around more. Lucius! We really made a difference, didn't we, Batman? Lucius! Is Lucius fucking dead? One killed and 14 injured after Wake a tragic explosion. The GCPD is tower. opening an investigation into what they are calling. I'm guessing there's no way to actually save him. Wayne Enterprise's chief technology officer, Lucius Fox, died last Tuesday in the violent blast. Oh my fucking god. A small god. service is being held for the tech giant and father of three at Divinity Church this Sunday. R.I.P. Lucius. Oh, God, Lucius. <sighs> you were at the center of everything we do. He was truly one of a kind. I, I don't know what we'll do without him. Seriously, he, like, made all my gadgets and shit. What am I going to do without him? Lucius, you, Bruce. I'll pay it it back. Family. Riddler's attack on the casino was one thing, but this, this is personal. We can't let him get away with it. Riddler struck at the heart of our operations. Riddler will pay for what he's done. I swear to you, I will make him suffer. Maybe it's what's called for, given the circumstances. Of course, it won't bring poor Lucius back. I can't imagine how devastated she must be to lose her father in such a violent way. <laughs> I should go talk to her. Yes, she can use all the support she can get. <laughs> hey, <laughs> Tiffany. I still can't believe he's gone. None of this. None of this feels real. <sighs> Tiffany, I... I know what you're going through. I remember what it was like when I lost my parents. <laughs> that, uh... Sudden emptiness. There's no feeling like it in the world. I don't think it'll ever go away. It certainly didn't. It doesn't. <laughs> yeah. He loved working for you, you know? They hardly saw him at home because of it. Mom used to complain when my little brother was growing up without a dad. Now I guess it's true. He was so busy. I can't remember the last time I got to hang out with him. That's so sad. Just father and daughter. I just thought there'd be more time. There were so many things I wanted to talk to him about. I know it's no consolation, but the work your father was doing, it was important. More important than family. 
Yes, like I saving what lives. Well, what did you mean? <sighs> Tiffany. I'm sorry. I know I shouldn't blame you. <laughs> hey, 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 it's okay. It's okay. Just let it out. I'm just trying to wrap my head around it all. I saw his remains, Bruce. There, there was hardly anything left. What were you guys working on that could have caused that? Uh-oh. It, it doesn't quite add up. Please tell me. Tiffany, I will tell you soon. Just not here. What do you mean? Why not? It's not the right time. What, Bruce? What are you mixed up in? <laughs> Fine. Some bad shit. Just... Tell me one thing. Are you Batman? Your disc. Was that what killed him? Did you put my father's life at risk for that? I'm begging you. Just tell me that one thing. I thought it was safe, Tiffany. I, I really did. I had no idea Lucius could get hurt. Please forgive me. Forgive you? I hope you can forgive yourself. Whatever you got my father into, I will find out. And I will shout it to the world. Uh, you tell the truth and this is what happens. No. So sorry, really. It's such a shame. At least he went out with a bang, oh. right? Oh my that, fucking god. Be grateful. You you knew my father. Well, no, but Whoa, whoa. What the heck? Seriously, Bruce? This guy's with you. I'm so sorry. I will handle this. Jeez, Bruce, that's quite a grip. Gonna leave a bruise for sure. What are you doing here? I told you I'd see you again, didn't I? You and me, we're two threads in the same stitch. Look, I, I, I got you a little something just, just to mark the occasion. I knew you'd be hurting, see? I thought it might make you feel better. Um, thank you, John. That's very considerate of you. Oh, good. I wasn't sure. First time at a funeral, you see. People get upset at the littlest things. It hasn't, um... It hasn't been easy for me out here, you know? I'm the new guy now. It's the freedom that gets to you. You're so damn much you hardly know what to do with it. <laughs> it's not like Arkham. Sometimes I miss those padded walls. You knew where the lines were drawn. Which ones not to cross. <laughs> You can't possibly mean that. Arkham is hell. It was my home, Bruce. Mm -hmm. My dog just opened home the door. Is where the heart is. I'm almost sorry that I convinced Dr. Leland to release me. If everyone could please take their seats, uh, we will begin. Would you just sit down? Today we gather to honor the memory of Lucius Fox. He was a friend, a father, a husband, a leader. You are crashing my friend's funeral, John. 
You better have a good reason. Oh, I do. I need that, uh, favor you owe me. You know, you might have been a little reluctant at the time, but if it wasn't for me, you'd still be in Arkham. You're sleeping off your meds in the rec room with Zaz. You're, you're gonna do right by me, aren't you? I know you're a man of your word. I never made that promise. I got into a lot of trouble for what we did, Bruce. You saw that place, saw those doctors. I kind of want to be nice to him and see what that where that goes. You see, I met some inspiring people out here, made some new friends, made a kind of pact. They're amazing, Bruce, that special breed who live by their own rules. They remind me of you, of your father. So who are they? You'll find out when you meet them. They're looking to bring someone like you into the fold. You, you will meet them for me, won't you? Please, I've, I've got a lot riding on this. I already told them you would. Please don't let me down. I'd be happy to chat with your friends, John. Just say when and where. Oh, I was so hoping you'd say that. We are going to have so much fun. No, I probably shouldn't have agreed. I knew this would work out. This air between us, this is real. You can't force this kind of friendship. I want to commemorate the moment. The guys will be so excited. Put that away. This is a funeral for God's sake. I, I'm sorry. I, I got so caught up in it all, I completely forgot. I just know you're gonna hit it off with the guys. I should warn you though. I've got an enemy. Real piece of work. Calls himself the Riddler. How do you know the Riddler? Know him? I want to rip his eyeballs out. He's a thief and a killer. And worst of all, he's... He's rude. I tried to let the authorities know the kind of lowlife they're dealing with, but... Wait a minute, you know him too. Of course, a man of Bruce Wayne's caliber knows everyone. Uh, just from the news. The guy's clearly a murderer, sick in the head. Don't know the half of it. If I had my way, that smarmy know-it-all would never leave his hole. Even his hole? You know where he is. No, no, not exactly, no. Maybe I said too much. I'm your friend, John. You can trust me. Uh, trust is the mainstay of any healthy relationship. I want that for us, Bruce. I really do. Yeah, I, I really don't know much. I heard the egomaniac always made people go to him for meetings. Somewhere in the East End. Where in the East End? Honestly, that's all I know. And even that might be out of date. If you're so eager to find him, why don't you let me help you? I'll find out where he is and get back to you. See if I can't find out where that jerk puts his head down. It'd be just like the old days. Do not get involved. When this clearly means so much to you. No, no. Don't you worry about a thing. I'll take care of this. Just meet my friends later. Like I asked. Okay. Look, I think I outstayed my welcome here. I'm, I'm just gonna slip away. Excuse me. I'm sorry. <laughs> It's been so nice catching up, Bruce. I miss this. This trust between us. I know we'll see each other again soon. Be in touch. Goodbye, Bruce. 
Until next time. Intriguing fellow. Certainly not one for decorum. I don't think that outburst went unnoticed. Well, whatever you say about John, he gave me a lead on Riddler's location. Inform Gordon. Tell him to drag up GCPD records on Gotham's East End. And tell him we're on Riddler's trail. My bad, man. Enjoying the view. Yeah, hard to do these days. It's one thing for the bad parts of town to get uglier, but when places like Wayne Tower start falling apart, it makes you wonder what's next. Yeah, I bet Bruce Wayne is wondering the same thing. Seems like the world's got it out for that guy. Spends some time in Arkham, gets drugged through the dirt by the media for something he didn't do. Wayne has a talent for finding himself in the crosshairs. Uh, you can say that again. You said you had a lead on Riddler. Hiding somewhere in the East End. Why am I not surprised? East End's been a no man's land since Harvey Dent blew it up. I've tried to get more patrols out there, but City Hall's not giving up the funds. The area between 42nd and 48th, more or less lawless. That narrows down the surge at least. I'm gonna open up this can. Looks like gang activity's heating up along 43rd. Uh, I'll see what I can do. Hey, I get it, but we're stretched thin, I told you. Uh, Riddler's a loner. I bet he's avoiding that area. The land at the end of 44th was recently purchased anonymously. Well, the only thing there is an old water tower. Hmm. Something feels fishy about that. My gut tells me that's the place. Agreed. Oh, nice work, Batman. If this leaf pans out, Waller will have to eat her words. <laughs> Whatever you said to her at the casino really got up her nose. I have to tell you, I got a bad feeling about her. How so? It's the way she goes after criminals. She's ruthless. Puts her people at risk. And believe me, she doesn't let due process get in her way. So stop at nothing. And I mean nothing to get her man. Fine with me. Whatever gets results. There's a line, Batman. Once you cross it, you stop being on the side of right. I was ordered to give her updates on breaks in the Riddler case. Well, if there's a chance he's there, we should probably let her know. Don't want to give her ammunition with the governor. Notify Waller. She's proven useful so far. Just be careful around her, huh? She moved her people into my downtown precinct without so much as a please or thank you. <laughs> I tell you, Batman, she keeps on chipping away at my authority. I'm gonna crack. Then let's find Riddler before it comes to that. I'll have my people call her people on the way. Riddler won't feel so clever after we come knocking. I told Waller about our lead on this place. She's caught up in briefings, can't get here for a while. She said she appreciates the cooperation. Not exactly cozy, is it? Let's see what we can learn. Someone's keeping a scrapbook. Vain, isn't he? See no evil, hear no evil, speak no evil.
Uh oh. Damn it! It's it's stuck. No way to open it from the inside. Then how do we get out? We go in. After you. Crack house any day. Oh, God. Special Agent Mario Fernandez. Holy crap. He's one of Waller's. He's missing parts of his fingers on the right hand. We saw this before. The victim in the casino. One of his pupils is fully dilated. The other's contracted. A clear sign of brain trauma. Huh. There's no sign of a blow to the head. The man bit his tongue clean through. He must have suffered a shock, or a sudden jolt. There's some hemorrhaging from the ears. His eardrums must have burst. One shoe is missing. The sole of the other one's almost completely melted through. What am I missing? No. Oh. <laughs> I was wasn't trying to look at his dick. Help. The phone isn't getting a signal. Damn it. Me either. That's a hell of an invitation. Riddler's playing games. That he tried to play along. We can learn from his mistakes. Let's find out what he did wrong. One shoe melted. Must belong to poor Cinderella over there. Facial feature. The senses, Thanks to the little follow the lunar senses. again for the night statue. time. You're right. There must be a connection. Safes with electronic locks. <sighs> Shut tight. These must be the goal of whatever game we're playing. Bleeds inside. And a lot of blood. Huh. We know Riddler likes penalizing his victims for wrong answers. Prototype of the trap he used on Mori. The armor. Extremely sturdy. Ensuring there's no possible way to open them other than solving his riddles. This is an insane way to commit crimes, even for this city. Mm. Metal mesh lining the walls. Riddler has converted this entire place into a giant Faraday cage. Faraday what? An enclosure designed to block electromagnetic fields. No signals in or out. Guess it explains why our phones aren't getting signals. Clever son of a bitch. The 
the agent must have been looking for the answer in one of these safes. He chose the wrong one. Cost him his fingers. filter has been tampered with like in sunglasses monitors typically have a polarizing filter to reduce reflection I don't see anything impossible to see with the naked eye we're going to have to look at it through a polarized lens That's an agency issue pistol. That's a hell of a jolt. I saw a takedown Riddler's goons at the casino. It was impressive. Gotta give it to Waller. Her people have great tech. More monkey statues. I'm starting to sense a theme here. Take a look at this. Huh. Well, that's the same kind of body cam the GCPD issues its officers. Maybe there's a clue on the recording. Can't hurt to look. Because you've been so candid with me, I'm giving you a chance your other comrades won't get. A chance at getting out of this alive. We'll catch you. The agency, they'll find... I shouldn't have to remind you that you've been chasing me for years. And I've always been two steps ahead. If you win the game, I'll let you go free, and you'll get a consolation prize. An exclusive sneak peek into how I'm going to kill all of your colleagues. <laughs> now how is that for motivation? Screw you! He had the agent bound while he beat him. sick contraptions some kind of murder box I guess well, he was always a wacko but this takes it to a new level it's still warm there must be some kind of heating element underneath this thing is built like an oven you could be cooked alive in there Must be locked in place. The glass. It's polarized. So it is. Turn me round, but not the right way, and you might live to see another day. What does it mean? This door were closed. The portal would be looking right at those monitors. Since the monitors have been tampered with, it's likely there's a message on it. One that can only be seen with a polarized lens. You won't know until you're inside the box, though. Hey, I got a hunch. Come here. No matter how careful Riddler is, chances are good he hasn't scrubbed his own computer. Good call. It's worth checking out. sold technology to Riddler. I talk about strange bedfellows. You know, Waller's been keeping pretty tight tabs on Maury for a while now. She must have known. I recognize some of the names on this list. They're all Waller's people. Names, addresses, phone numbers. We have to warn her. First, we have to get out of here. Uh, what does it say? Riddler's not working alone. 
Just wonderful. More psychos to worry about. He and his colleagues. They don't see eye to eye. Apparently, they don't like his beef with me. Hey, maybe we'll get lucky they'll kill each other. <laughs> Bad joke. <laughs> Okay. The floor of the box heated up while the agent was inside. He tried standing on one foot to save the other, causing that shoe to catch on fire. When he exited the box, he tried to put the fire out but couldn't, so he threw off his shoe. You got a VR in that cow or something? Yes. Something like that. I've got all the pieces of Riddler's puzzle. Now I need to know what order they have it in. The chair. Agent woke up here where his body cam fell off. Once he found he couldn't call for help, he saw the message on the monitors and willingly put himself inside the murder box. The agent's shoe caught fire inside the murder box, so he opened it in a panic. As soon as he was out of the box, he ripped off the burning shoe and threw it. Somewhere in the confusion, he must have missed something crucial. From where he lost his shoe, the agent beelined for the wall of safes. He opened one, but chose poorly. The blade sliced off his fingers. And there he met his end. Though it's still unclear how and when his eardrums could have burst. The agent made a number of mistakes. Mistakes we can avoid. The heat inside the box forced him to run out before he could... Before he could get Riddler's next clue. Poor bastard couldn't withstand the heat. The bat suit's armor is heat resistant. It'll buy me more time to find Riddler's next clue. Getting inside the box and starting the game is the only way we're getting out of here. This is insane. You know that. The last man who went in there is dead. There's a good chance it'll kill you, too. Any mistake could be my last. I won't be able to do this without you, Joe. Well, when you put it like that, let's win this game. I'm trying to. Monkeys. See no evil, hear no evil, speak no evil. But which one is he referring to? Whichever one it is, the correct safe will have a face with those senses removed. Yeah, I'll check. Ah, damn it. It's still locked shut. They should unlock when I open this door. Ultrasonic device. 
Let's test it out, shall we? The riddle! Use it to open the savings! I'll put a stop to this damn choice! One won't see trouble, one lies. As the third, he hides the prize. Hear no evil, hear no evil, hear no evil, speak no evil, speak no evil. Okay, I completely missed it then. Ultrasonic device. Yeah, we heard all this before. Let's test it out, shall we? The riddle! Use it to open the savings! I'll put a stop to this damn choice! <laughs> Oh, it's here, yeah. I didn't, I, I, I just now cut on to what the, what I meant. Just in case. Damn. Now, oh, for the love of God, whatever's in that safe, it'll be worth all this pain. It's a homing missile. What does it home in on? Looking at its schematics now. A signal. A radio signal. A signal. That's... That's how he died. How who died? That's how they'll all die. Riddler. Mori sold me missiles for all of my enemies. Everyone on my list gets one. Most won't even know what's coming. For a brief second, their dull existences will light up. Why are you doing this, Riddler? Haven't you killed enough? I have a lot of enemies, Batman. While they're still breathing, I still have work to do. I'm trying to get a handle on you, Batman. Partnering with Gordon is one thing. From what I remember of the old days, he's harmless enough. Yeah, we'll see about that when you're in cuffs. But the agency, they're a natural enemy to people like you and me. You must be desperate if you're making friends with them. You must be really up against the ropes to want that government scum in your corner. They're no friends of mine. No, they're not. They'll smile to your face to get what they want. The agency uses people, Batman. Corrupts them, breaks their minds. I wasn't always like this. The agency made me. No, this is garbage. Yeah, Waller's a hard ass, sure, but she had nothing to do with why he's so messed up. I didn't say Waller, did I? This goes way before her time. But I don't forget. That's the thing about having a mind like mine. You remember everything. Save your sob story for jail. I'm not interested. You think I want sympathy? This is my city. I was running things in Gotham before you could walk. I just wanted to see if the man who saves everyone is really as good as he believes. But then, you already answered that for me, didn't you? When you offloaded my puzzle on your friend. 
Why don't you tell Gordon here what happened to Lucius Fox? Watch out, Commissioner. For all his preaching, Batman knows when to sacrifice a pawn to win the game. It That's was not what happened. Move. Getting out of the way of the blast. Something only a pragmatist would do. Don't you dare put your crimes on me. <laughs> Come on, Batman. I gave the puzzle to you, didn't I? It's not my fault you couldn't solve it. Look at Gordon. He doesn't know what to make of any of it. Trust is hard-earned, yet easily lost, isn't it? Come on now. Don't get your tights in a twist. I knew you weren't sharp enough to do it on purpose. There's no room at the top for schoolboys who are too squeamish to fight in the gutter. You don't have what it takes to be a player in this town. Not without giving up those values you hold so dear. Game on! I'll wait for Waller and pass on what we found. She won't be happy when she finds out Riddler knows about every agency operative in Gotham. I don't blame her. If they were my cops, no one would be sleeping till we found this Riddler guy. Just keep your eyes open, Jim. In the meantime, I'll stay on Riddler's tail. Hey, hey, hold up a sec. What Riddler said in there about the agency? Smoke and mirrors, you ask me. But the thing about Lucius Fox and the blast at Wayne Tower? You gotta level with me. You got some connection with that Wayne Tech guy you didn't tell me about? I'd tell you if I could, Jim. Now it's like that, huh? As I said, if I could. I gotta say, the fact I had to learn about it from Riddler instead of you... ...it doesn't sit right with me at all. I thought we had some trust, you and I. What do you expect me to do with this? Am I just supposed to sit on my hands? Pretend I never heard any of it? Jim, what you're asking... There's no easy way to talk about it. Yeah, I gathered that much. I mean, I wasn't born yesterday. I know you probably have a network of civilians working for you. You can't do the kinds of things you do without a gigantic support system. And as much as I understand your reluctance to talk, it doesn't make me feel any better about this. Batman. Uh, I'll be waiting to hear from you. That's chapter five. I heard your discussion with Commissioner Gordon. Now he knows that Lucius Fox and the Batman are, were, allies. Gordon's dangerously close to figuring out who you are. If he does find out, I have no idea how he'll react. He looked me straight in the eye, Alfred. He's been our friend a long time. He deserves to know. I understand that, Bruce, but he's still too close for comfort. I'm sorry, but he is. You were radio silent for so long. Tell me, did you find out how Lucius died? This is a missile I found in Riddler's workshop. The explosion at Wayne Tower. We were thinking about it all wrong. The puzzle wasn't an explosive. It was an emitter. When it was solved, it emitted a signal. You heard it earlier. If allowed to play too long, it becomes a launch signal. Dear God! You did solve the box. We just didn't know it. The Batcave Scrambler blocked the signal. Poor Lucius. Wayne Tower offered no such protections. 
Our tight little family has gotten smaller because of it. It was the three of us looking out for each other. We still have you. And we still have each other. I won't always be here, Bruce. Uh, I'm sorry. Losing Lucius in such gruesome fashion, it puts me in rather a morbid mood. The list of agency operatives from Riddler's workshop. He plans to do the same thing to them. It's a hit list. It's only useful if he has a way to target the agents, though. And I doubt he's setting them all puzzle boxes. Why does that Pull one on, only have three numbers? Walk through it. He's hacked their cell phones. He could pinpoint the location of any one of these operatives. his signal through their phone to make them a target of a missile strike. Can you block it? If I can get a clean copy of the signal, yes. It's the only way I can get a clean version of the signal. It's pretty grim, Alfred. You don't have to watch. I can handle it. I've never been one to shy away from duty. Of course you can. Let's get this over with. Bruce, get my daughter out of the building. Get yourself out. What are you talking What did you figure out? I've... I've solved the Riddler's puzzle, Bruce. He knew he was going to die. Oh. Can you switch to audio only, please? Tell Tiffany that I love her. That I'm sorry I wasn't around more. Lucius? We really made a difference, didn't we? That man? Uh, I, uh, I, I, I shouldn't have watched this. I'll, uh, I'll go get that tea, Master Bruce. All right. Now I just need to create a filter to get a clean version of the signal. And then match up the points found in both sound files. Tiffany. Bruce. Tower. Enterprises. Batman. Tiffany. 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 That's a match. Bruce? Batman? Dwayne? To the Sable? Riddler? Bruce? Dwayne? I still think I'm on the wrong track. The two sounds have to be the same. Yeah, I got it. Waveforms match. There. I've piggybacked on the Riddler's cell phone hack. They'll recognize any incoming signal match and shut down, negating a launch. Makes sense for me to have a signal on me as well. What for? Riddler still has functioning missiles. Once he finds out I've blocked his targets, he may decide to launch indiscriminately. But with the signal, I might be able to divert them. 
Tiffany gave me this the day Lucius died. Let's put it to good work. It's not a theory I really want to test. So we had better find Riddler first. There is always Riddler's second in command. Eli Nabel, arrested after his attack on the casino. None of the authorities have gotten anything out of him yet. Unknown contact. What is it? That John guy from the funeral from Arkham. He got my fucking number, how? Who actually sounds like he's keeping his word. Mori, huh? John thinks that Mori can get us Riddler's location. Do you believe him? Maybe we should go back to the beginning. Bring Rumi Mori up on the back computer. Either of them could potentially lead me to him. The question is, which is more likely to help you? Mori's a businessman. Given the right incentive, he could be persuaded to talk. He sure can't have any love for Riddler after his attempted murder at the casino. I'd say he'd respond better to a more genteel approach. Peer-to-peer -peer as Bruce Wayne. However, the agency is watching him. If Waller finds out that Bruce Wayne sought a parley with Mori, she'll not be best pleased. On the other hand, Riddler's lieutenant, Eli Nabel, took a go at me in the casino, put up quite a fight. Cracking him will be tougher, more physical. Certainly a job for Batman. He's currently in Waller's custody in a GCPD holding cell. Interrogating Nabel there would be a visible endorsement of Waller's authority. Gordon won't like it. Maury. I'll with Maury. I'm sure Bruce Wayne can find a way to reason with him. We want to get on Gordon's good side, because we all like Gordon. Riddler's people are here, watching Mori. Riddler's agency data should make him easy to tag. I need you to keep an eye on him for me. Maybe cause a distraction if I need it. Gotta be careful here. They're following his every move. All this attention. Must be annoying to a man like Mori. I see them. All of these agents were on Riddler's list. Even without access to their phones, he'll still try to kill them all somehow. Do whatever it takes to find him, Bruce. I never want to see another video like the one with Lucius. No time to waste. Mr. Wayne, to what do we owe this honor? Good evening, Mr. Mori. I've come to talk. Your visit is unexpected, Mr. Wayne. What can I do for you? A private matter between friends. There's something you can help me with, Mr. Mori. It's a matter of some importance. 
I doubt I can do much. The authorities are watching my every move. Apparently, I'm a person of interest. There's really not much I can offer you other than a drink and a seat at the roulette wheel. Not while I'm being shadowed. We need privacy. Lose the agents. Done. They just got an order to sweep the perimeter. Should give you a couple of minutes at least. Impressive, Mr. Wayne. <laughs> we haven't even scratched the surface. What can I do for you? Information. About the Riddler. Why would I do that? We are on the same side of this, Mori. I was here in the casino that night. I saw what he did to you. It's only a matter of time before he comes at you again. Maybe you're right. I dealt with that maniac, it's true. But I was done after the first delivery. Riddler wanted more. Everything he could get his hands on. He even wanted me to hand over one of my biotech companies. I said no. That's why he attacked you. You have no idea how crazy he is. I only wish I had known it sooner. Actually, I have a pretty good idea. I see that you do. He scared me. I was afraid he'd use my goods in the city. After the explosion at Wayne Enterprises, it turns out I was right. I want you to know, I had no idea the Riddler had marked you as a target. I knew your father, back when he was running Gotham. Our interests often aligned. I would never dishonor his memory. He was a friend, truly one of a kind. And you owe me, for my father's sake. <laughs> that was a long time ago, and favors go both ways. I can help you find the Riddler, Mr. Wayne. I sold him the missile array he's using to pick off his enemies. He won't be very far from it. Everything you need to find him is on that drive. But I need a favor from you first. A favor? Waller has me detained here pending Riddler's trial. He controls all my accounts. I need to get out of the country, and in all haste. You can help with that. Otherwise, I fear my fate is a short, miserable life in a black prison. I could do that for you. I knew I could count on your friendship. A chartered plane waits for me at the airport. The pilot will fly me to a safe haven in the Caribbean for the right price. All you have to do is authorize a transfer. You don't want me as an enemy, Mr. Wayne. Our agency friends will be back any second. Let's handle this quickly and without disturbance. Everyone gets what they want. No deal. This could have been a lot easier for you, Mori. You should kill me, Wayne, because I won't forget! Bruce, Wallace's agents are converging. Hurry up and get out of there. Gotta do what you gotta do. Alfred, I've sent you Mori's information. Find me what I need, fast. Wasn't gonna help criminal scum get away. Armed men on board. This must be it. what the Riddler has up his sleeve.
I hear him. Need to get a better angle. You'll see what's gonna happen. My friends will all be here soon. Then you'll see what this is all in. We found him. You agency embassy. Mori's information turned out to be accurate. You and your boss. No sight of the missiles yet, though. They must be here somewhere. All your idiot hostages. They appear to be more of Waller's agents. Individuals for institutional cover. A good spot for cover. Your agency has a history of terrible decisions. Your agency has been on my heels far too long. I'll give it to you. You're relentless. I'll admit it's going to feel satisfying to get my revenge on your predecessors. Wait for it. Even if you're really just a small part of my plan. Don't want to raise an alarm. You'll see what I mean, I'll soon. move when he isn't looking. They might be angry I brought you here, but when they understand why, they'll recognize my brilliance. <laughs> After all, I am uniquely qualified to see the big picture. You brought this on yourselves. All of you. You government clods really thought you were smarter than me. It's clear you're in desperate need of some schooling. My friends will be here soon. I keep your mouths shut until then. Hostages first. When they're safe, I can find the missiles. Targeting online. Ready, Bruce. can't possibly think clunking a few heads is enough to make me roll over. Oversized vermin! talking Are you all right? Oh god. Not more. is the shock device. I've memorized your playbook, Batman. I know all your shallow tricks. Maury was incapable of learning his lesson. I knew he'd lead you to me eventually. All part of the plan. The missiles. Bait. Just like the hostages were bait. I knew you couldn't bear to let these agents die. <laughs> you care too much about the little people. That makes you weak. I saw how you saved Mori. You're wrong, Riddler. It makes me a hero. It's what makes me different <laughs> from you. It's why I'm out here, and you're in there. About to meet your maker. My partners were supposed to be here to see this. I guess I can just show them the bodies. I'm going to ask you three questions. Get them wrong, one of these agents gets torn apart. You won't get away with this. You get them right? This happens! I designed this for you, Batman. The hero who saves people will die knowing he couldn't save everyone. Let's get started. We have a lot to get through. I'm curious to see how you'll handle it all! Ask your questions, Riddler. 
Let's get this over with. Oh, good. I was hoping you'd cooperate. But I don't think the agent next to you shares your enthusiasm. You can handle the sonic blasts. But her... I estimate three blasts at most before her insides rupture. This one should be easy, Batman. Close to the heart. I solved a puzzle box for the Bat. Now I'm dead. And I mean dismembered. Closed casket for sure kind of dead. Who am I? If you know the answer, please say it. My colleagues will die otherwise. Speak up, Batman. Lucius. What was that? I couldn't hear you. Lucius Fox. Very good, Batman. You saved a life. But... Thank you. Batman, don't answer any more of his questions. No, Blake. I won't let you die. Number two. Also, completely self-evident. I am black and blue and bleeding from the ears. Who am I? I think... I think he means me. Say it. Don't you dare answer that! Please, don't let him die! Say it! I need an answer! You're too clever for me, Riddler. I don't know how to answer. Finally, some humility from you. It's, it's a shame it's not what I'm looking for. No! Avesta, please! Please! Blake! Oh my god, Blake! I should have answered. Do I fail that? Enough, Riddler. You made your point. Just one more, Batman. And then it'll all be over. I'll distract him. Just get us out of here. I'm the sharpest mind you'll ever meet. The original genius with Gotham at my feet. Who am I? You're Riddler. Riddler's the genius. Well done, Agent. You answered so quickly, you almost deserve not to get the blast. I'll fire one of the missiles. Use the bad cam to make it target the cage. And use a Riddler's trap to protect Emon and myself from the explosion. I like what you're saying, Agent Avesta, but you're not the one I need to hear it from. Missile armed, ready to fire. Who's the genius, Batman? Who's on top of Gotham now? I want to hear it from you. I am. What are you doing? Don't you? You could... Who's the man who's got no time left? The Riddler. 
Thought you'd get such an easy one right. Those missiles are aimed right at the city. The answer is Batman. Batman, I... Lake and I tracked Riddler's ship through the Port Authority logs. We thought we could bring him in ourselves. Riddler snatched us straight off the docks. I should have said no. Urged caution. And now... And now my colleagues are... All we did was hand Riddler more hostages. Not true. I wouldn't have been able to stop him without you. That's not true. Thank you, Batman. It's good to know we've got Riddler in custody. Despite the cost. It's over, Riddler. Look forward to a padded cell. Is this really a victory for you, Batman? You're the one in cuffs. Yeah, but you're the one that broke your precious rules. You let one agent die to save another. <laughs> well, that can't sit right with you. Can it? Must be an uncomfortable feeling. This entire twisted situation is your doing, Riddler. All blame is on you. And so are the consequences. Is it? You came at me, remember? Not the other way around. I pushed the Batman to his limits. Tested his precious code. Huh. And my comrades would have been impressed. I set this all up to show them. I thought they'd back me up, even if they didn't agree. They left me here to deal with you alone. They... They betrayed me. I look forward to meeting these friends of yours. They're next on my list. Good. They deserve it. Unless... Unless that white-faced prick set me up. Never told them to meet me here. I'm gonna research if you can save everybody, because I would like to. Lock the ship down and radio for more medics.
but Riddler, is he? Oh, god damn it. Oh, this isn't good, Batman. The investigation is a dead end without a breathing suspect. We're in trouble. A lot of trouble. I have no idea how we're getting out of it. I saved lives today, Jim. That's a victory. Now that counts for something, sure. But it's not enough to keep the gods at bay. Oh, Waller is gonna come down on us like a thunderbolt. Thunderbolt? I'm the whole goddamn hurricane. I'm about to blow both your asses off the side of this ship. This is a goddamn mess. Agent Blake is dead. Riddler is dead. And I don't know exactly how. But I know you tampered with my suspect at the casino. Unless you expect me to believe that Maury's new neck brace is a fashion statement. Batman is clearly being misused as an asset to the GCPD. I'm taking direct control of law enforcement in Gotham, effective immediately. What? Gordon, you're being relieved of your stars. Bumped down to deputy ops. You can't demote me. Gordon's been fighting the good fight for years. You're delusional if you think you can solve all our problems. You're the ones who are deluded. You're so busy gazing into each other's eyes, you can't see the big picture. Take some vacation days, Gordon. I've got sensitive case details to discuss with Batman. We're still in this together, Batman. This doesn't change a thing. This city is about to find itself in a crisis the likes of which it's never known. Riddler had a crew. Not just any crew. The worst criminal minds from all over the world, here in Gotham. You come across anything about them? I'm assuming you've heard of them by now. There's a guy. Calls himself John Doe. He's either a member, or he knows who is. That confirms some theories we had. Doe's a one-time patient of another member of the group. Dr. Harleen Quinzel. <gasps> Harley Quinn. Arkham Asylum. She's very elusive. Keeps her head down. They Much better not so fuck up her. I've gotten to like Riddler's voice acting. Once we captured him Harley better sound like Harley. But if Harley doesn't have, have that kind of... A man Accent. who lives on both sides of the line and knows exactly when to cross it. Yeah. If they fuck up Harley's, this game is gonna be, be working very bad. Very closely. Bruce Wayne. Well, she knows who I am. So, it's cool that Harley's in this. Harley better have a good voice actor. It better sound like every Harley ever. If they fuck up Harley's voice, because Joker's already kind of eh, they better do good on Harley's point. Okay. I didn't mean to.
All right, well, that was episode one. I might end the stream here. I want to see if I can save all the agents, but I don't know how it goes. So I can I have to restart the entire episode like I can't like there's not a chapter select that I can like change my outcome I'm gonna Google that real quick. You can't, oh, that's kind of annoying. Alright, I guess we'll have to continue playing, unless I replay the entire two-hour chapter over again. And I don't think I'm gonna do that, it, even though this is a good game. I feel bad that I had them killed. I, I didn't know if you... I would have much rather saved her than the two agents, which is kind of fucked up, but I, th I, I, I don't know if, like... You can save all of them or not? Let's see here. Alright, I just looked it up and it says, so spoiler alert if anyone was wanting to play this or try out different ones for yourself, you click off the video, go to my next episode, I'm probably going to end the stream soon anyways, but I just looked it up and it says that if I answered all the questions correctly, I would have saved their lives, however, the detective that was with me, the agent that was with Batman, would have gone deaf. Which I guess is somewhat better in her case, but the route I went with, she's now overburdened with guilt. Which could prove some bad things later on in the episodes, but I would rather not have her deaf, I guess. I don't know. I'm probably gonna look at some other people's playthroughs of this and see what really happens with their character after we beat this so anyways thanks everyone for watching this episode depending on that so this episode is pretty long it's about two hours over two hours so i'm going to end the stream here i'm going to start up another stream right afterwards and i'm going to get this stream started to upload on youtube depending on how long the next episode is i might start episode two and three in the next stream but this is just episode one hope you guys enjoyed thanks to anyone that checked out the stream and i'll see you next time